Hi guys, Glenn Anderson here, the natural strongman, and welcome to my video. So today was pressing assistance day, so I did axle press, some seated dumbbells, um, some shoulder, other shoulder exercises, and some shoulder stability exercises, and then um, some rows and stuff, and then finished up with um, Stairmaster afterwards, just for some conditioning. So I didn't really film it all, but this video is just like footage of what I did film. So let's take a look. Enjoy. Okay, so this is the first thing I did, ball jump. This is six feet, six inches, which is my current personal best at the moment. Um, it is getting harder bit by bit. This was quite hard, but I'm confident I can do a little bit more, so I will try and do more next week. Okay, now moving on to axle bar clean and push press. My favourite. So this first one is £226. This is the first set. So today's uh, training was to do five sets of three reps. So I started here at uh, 102 and a half kilos, and yeah, this was fairly easy. Um, the basically the protocol I follow this is I I start fairly light and then try and make even weight jumps. So this is the second set at 110 kilos. So I've increased by seven and a half kilos, and I will do again for the following one. This is still quite easy for me at the moment, uh, but the aim was to, by the fifth set, try to end with a PR, since I'm going to be going a bit lighter next week, so I really wanted to push this today and see if I could hit a new three rep max. So again, another 7.5 kilo increase, so we're now up to 117.5 kilos, or 259 pound. Now, when it comes to axle, I'm good at the clean, it's the press that I struggle with, as you can see there, look, I can easily clean the weight. Um, but with this, I've got the strength to do it, but my technique has to be absolutely right. There we are, so we've got that. So um, the first one was a little bit off there, but once I got into my groove, as you can see, I was all right after that. Um, I've just got to really concentrate. Once I've got it on the chest, I have to make sure that I breathe properly and I have to make sure I concentrate properly. Okay, so this is set number four at 125 kilos or 275 pounds. So my previous three rep max at this point was 122 and a half. So by doing this, I've now set a new three rep max. So this is the most I've done for three reps. I'm quite pleased with this. Again, as you notice, I wasn't concentrating there. My, if, once, if my technique is off, uh, that's not good. And that's the thing that I really need to be careful of when I go with, for one rep maxis. I have to make sure that my technique is there because even if my technique is off a little bit, I, I will fail. So uh, I did that. Uh, so I went to 127.5. I tried to get three rep max on this. But to be honest, I was really fatigued. As you can see, I was quite tired there, really. But again, I tried to... And my wrist was hurting as well, but I tried to fight through the pain and carry on. But by the time I got to that third rep, I just had nothing left. I was just fatigued, so that was it. Fuck, yeah, I weren't pleased with that. But then saying that, I kind of... It wasn't too bad because um, I've, I did 127 and a half. Not so long ago, that was my one rep max. Who doesn't really like a bit of a sound? A bit of good music in the gym today. Um, yeah, so not so long ago, 127 and a half was my one rep max on Axel, and now I'm repping it, so it's not the end of the world. Okay, so this is uh, Snatch Grip Barbell Rows. This is actually the third set. I didn't film the first two. 150. This is the fourth set now. Uh, the first set was 115 times 10. The second set was 130 times 10. And the third set was 142 and a half. And this is the fourth and final set. So this is 150 kilos for 10 reps. As an interesting side note, all you WWE fans, the music that was playing over this was Always, which was the theme to uh, WWF Survivor Series 2002. Little bit of trivia there for you. Okay, so I wanted to share with you um, a little conditioning protocol that I do, which is the Stairmaster. Uh, but I probably do it a little bit differently than most do. So hello and welcome. We've now joined me. I do 10 minutes on the Stairmaster. This was right at the end of my workout just to finish up as a conditioner. 
So I'd already done um, my broads jump. I'd already done some face pulls. I'd done five sets of three of heavy axle bar presses, ending up with 127 and a half kilos. After that, I did some seated dumbbell presses and some other shoulder stuff and shoulder stability, and then I finished up with snatch grip rows. So by the time I'd done all that, I was quite fatigued, and now I'm jumping on to the Stairmaster. Now, I was seven and a half minutes in when I started filming. I'm only going for 10 minutes, so this video just basically shows you the last two and a half minutes of the Stairmaster. And the way that I do it is I do every other minute. So I go hard for one minute up to level 10 at the moment. So I'm on the eighth minute, so I'm going at level 10. Uh, but the way I do it is I alternate between level 10 and level 1. So the on the start of the first minute, I will go up to level 10 and go for a full minute. I will then drop down to level 1 and take it nice and easy for a minute. And then I'll go back up to level 10 again for a minute and so on and so on. And I do that for 10 minutes. So we're on the eighth minute now and I'm at level 10. And as you can see, I've done just over 500 floors worth. We're now coming to the ninth minute. So as you notice, as soon as I hit the ninth minute, now I'm reducing the level of effort back down to level one, which is the lowest. And I'm now going to finish out the last minute just going at level one. Uh, I do believe the machine, that, well, the machine goes up to level 25. So by doing level 10, I'm only working at 40% of the machine's capacity. Um, now, level 10 for me is not too bad, to be honest. Um, I think I'll probably be able to get up to about like level 15 or so before I start struggling. I mean, anyone that can do level 25 is pretty much superhuman, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, but I will, next time I'll go up to level 11 and then so on and so on. I'll gradually increase it until it gets so hard that I just can't keep up with it. And then I'll stay on that until I can. So anyway, we're coming to the end of the workout. So... Uh, Thank you for watching. This is my 10 minutes on the Stairmaster. Now, as you can see, I did over 540 floors. Okay, see you soon. Okay, so that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, my next training day should be Wednesday, and I'm going to be doing some front squats, deadlifts, hopefully some farmers walking some stones and stuff. So I'll try and do a video of that. So thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you soon for the next video.